The materials used to manufacture PCB are prepreg, copper foil, and copper clad laminate. Prepreg is a B stage dielectric material that is tacky and allows bonding of copper foil and different laminates. Copper foil serves as conductive traces on PCBs. Plies of prepregs bonded together form the core of a PCB. This core is cladded with copper foil on either sides to form a copper clad laminate. While choosing dielectric material, we need to consider electrical and thermal properties of the dielectric material used. Electrical properties include dielectric constant and loss tangent. Dielectric constant is the ratio of electric permittivity of the material to electric permittivity of free space. It generally decreases as frequency increases. DK for most PCB materials range between 2.5 and 4.5. The loss tangent or dissipation factor is the phase angle between the resistive and reactive currents in the dielectric. Low values of DF result in a fast substrate, while large values result in slow substrate. Thermal properties include glass transition temperature, decomposition temperature, thermal conductivity, and coefficient of the thermal expansion. When the temperature rises above Tg, the PCB substrate transitions from a glassy, rigid state to a softened, deformable state. Similarly, Td is a temperature at which material decomposes chemically. Thermal conductivity is the property of a material to conduct heat. Low thermal conductivity means low heat transfer while high conductivity means high heat transfer. CTE is the rate of expansion of a PCB material as it heats up. It is expressed in parts per million. CTE along with Z-axis should be less than 70 ppm per degree Celsius. Signal loss or attenuation increases with frequency. Certain materials exhibit low loss at high frequency. Materials like Isola I-speed and Isola Tachyon 100G exhibit low loss when operating at high frequencies. PCB materials are categorized by an operating frequency in normal speed, normal loss, medium speed, medium loss, high speed, low loss, and very high speed, very low loss materials. Material selection is important for all PCB designs. The goal is always to select the right material for manufacturability, at the same time meets your temperature and electrical requirements.